What's up, all you good fellow fly guys? You know who it is, the cat in the hat, your resident fly guy, your chief architect, Michelangelo, styarchitects.com, here to help you redesign your frame of mind when it comes to the styling thing. And it's trending Thursdays. Yo, you are almost through with the week. You've almost made it. So I hope that you are showing up in style. If you are not sure on how to do so, or you're having some trouble, you're having questions, uh, then that's what we are here for, is to make sure that you are dressing yourself with the best of yourself. Today, we're going to be talking about uh, the trend that I keep on seeing in menswear right now. It's been about two or three years, haven't really seen it transition yet, but I'm sure it will. And that is this whole spread collar movement. Um, it is continuing to, to catch wind and it's probably at its peak at this point and beginning to decline. I think we're going to start seeing uh, a little bit more conservative uh, types of collars as the community and our global community tends to be a little bit more conservative. Uh, we tend to get away from the flair of certain things and with the state of everything, I think we might start seeing a little bit more of a conservative expression and style. So you may see some more straighter collars uh, coming in in the next two to three years um, but right now I've still seen this and every guy is going out here getting these spread collars and I get it you want to do that so you can get your big knots when you're wearing your ties you want to uh, be able to show that you're in style you're in the know uh, or you're in fashion and you're in the know and you know what's going on but the challenge is as we talked about on Tuesday is that this may not be the best reflection of your framing for your day now uh, for me, it does work because I have a more ovular face. See, you can see I got an ovular face. I'm not afraid to show my head. You always see me in a hat. I'm not scared. Take off my hat. Uh, <laughs> but when you are looking, you want to make sure that you have a longer face if you are going to be wearing spread collars because that it's going to create a balance. So again, if you see with me without my, my hat on, it still creates a certain level of balance for my ovular head. If I had a longer head, again, the spread may want to be leaving a little bit wider. But uh, even when I'm wearing my hats, which we'll talk about in some upcoming conversations, my hats tend to be wider, so it creates a certain level of balance as well. And so when you're talking to, to guys who are looking to uh, make sure that they're showing up with their best spread collars may not be the best way to go if you are into that whole spread collar movement try to find something that is going to be longer as far as the cut so it may come down but it still has a spread at the base of the collar that way you'll still have some spread there um, but it won't be overwhelming and making your head look like that football head that I was telling you, or what did I say basketball head Tuesday? Probably basketball head. Um, so you don't want to look that way. And those are some uh, quick things that you can utilize in order to change those. And with all of the different shirt manufacturers and great uh, developments that you can use in customizing your shirt, uh, it makes no sense for you to be following trends when you could just be showing up at the best of yourself. So this quick video, I'm gonna leave you with that. You can try that on, see how it fits you. Question of the day, have you been following that spread collar uh, trend? And if so, why? Again, I could be wrong. It could be something else that you're thinking about when you are wearing your spread collar shirt. But I would definitely love to hear your thoughts there to make sure that you are dressing yourself with the best of yourself. Please make sure that you give this a thumbs up. If you found this information beneficial, please make sure that you subscribe. If you're feeling the vibe, we're here every Monday through Friday at 12.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time to make sure that you are showing up in style. Please make sure that you share this with a friend. You never know. They might need it. And lastly, before I get out of here, don't ever forget that dress is nothing more than the expression of a man's state of mind. So you should always dress to express. See you tomorrow. Peace.